Hello from Slovenia again. I will do another reverse flower dip. I already started my video before and then the post man commented. I just I will start over. So today I will use some I mixed um, my white here and a little of burnt sienna and a little bit of gold for my base and I will use this color in the flower too and I will again experiment a little with this uh, cadence colors so today I will use what is with this uh, light again this is chocolate metallic chocolate it's so beautiful so I hope so for some lacing lacing from this one and this one is whoops this one is a little thin maybe uh, this one is uh, cyclamen I don't know this is the you know the flower that it blooms in I don't know <laughs> I will show you my bottle where are you here you are Sai Sai Slamen. I don't know. You see this one, and these are this Cadence Dora line. And I have a Lizarian Violet with a little bit of blue black, and I have a permanent red violet. And here I have uh, uh, Van Dyke Brown and I added a little bit of black to darken it up and a little bit of gold to give it some shimmer maybe. And I struggle again with light. Uh, and if you will hear some, it will be better, yes, uh, noise my uh, we renovate our bathroom so you will probably hear <laughs> over here so uh, I will start I want this brown edge so I will start with this chocolate this color looks so beautiful I'm just curious how it will look and then a Lizarian violet And again, I think that my paints are a little on the thick side. I don't know. And this permanent red violet. I know that now they look quite similar, but they don't. They aren't. And this metallic kind of violet. It's not violet at all still looks thick thin and on dark brown hope that this will not turn out too 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 brownish and this one that I have in my back for my background kind of flash color or something let's go once more with this chocolate 
and the Lizarian Violet. And permanent red violet. And this cyclamen. This one is really thin. We will see how this will work. And one dyke brown. And this flesh kind of color. Okay, I will blow my paint. And now let's do our petal shape. So I will drag this towards the sides and then I will decide if I even want to do a middle uh, to switch, if I even want to switch this because I don't know what is wrong with this. Let's see what is underneath. Maybe I will just leave it like it is. I will not switching it this time. I will just leave it like this. And what I will do today differently, I will use dry paper napkin, not wet to see what will happen if we use dry one and I will just drag this a little towards the middle oops okay this one okay so let's see I will grab this other one that I have it's a little smaller so probably it will be harder for me to lift it up nice but we will see okay so let's tap this a little bit probably it will be a challenge for me to leave this up because I'm not used to use dry paper napkin but just to try maybe it will even work okay we will see. And the last one. And I can already see that I have quite some problems with lifting this up. But I hope that it will not be so bad and it's not it's quite okay quite <laughs> and again 
it turned out more square that I would love to at all and maybe some of you will say again that I'm negative and never happy and I get quite some comments about my I don't know how to say that but um, I didn't get lacing from that um, chocolate color. You see, I get lacing just with uh, the Ciclama paint. <laughs> so, I don't know. Let me show you. So maybe this paint should be a little thinner to create lacing. But I was really hoping for some brown lacing on the top of the purples and I didn't get it so. But um, I'm pretty sure that someone will like that one too. I would love to have it a little different, but you see, because this was a little thinner, I did get some kind of bleeding into the background. But I hope that it will be okay. So, I will leave it to dry. I like it that way, probably. You see, because of the center, it kind of looks look nice this way. But as I said, I was expecting some uh, more lacing from this chocolate color maybe it will came out a little more because I see some lacing here but not much around we will see how it will dry I'm not uh, don't get me wrong, it's not bad flower, but uh, I was expecting a little different result, but I still am not disappointed at all because it's um, neat in its own way, so we will see how it will dry. And this is it for today and see you on the next one. Bye!